Alleging sexual abuse at uh, cheerleading gyms across the nation has now reached Raleigh, and now Wake County athletes are being banned from certain competitions. CBS 17's Dina Harley is live for us tonight at Cheer Extreme. And Dina, that lawsuit alleges the abuse happened there. Yeah, that's right. The lawsuit was actually filed in South Carolina, but the lawsuit alleges that a boy attended this gym and was abused by people who worked here. This gym is also working with a group called Varsity Spirit. It's a nationwide group, but now Wake County says that their cheerleaders cannot compete in any competitions with that group. An online petition has over 300 signatures from parents and community members who want to see Wake County cheerleaders compete. The athletes were banned from performing in certain competitions after Varsity Spirit, that national cheerleading organization, became involved in several lawsuits alleging sexual abuse by several coaches. Those lawsuits started out of state, but last week a federal lawsuit was filed after a boy said he was abused by somebody associated with Cheer Extreme in Raleigh, a group with coaches associated with Varsity Spirits. Now, since that latest lawsuit, Wake County Public Schools has banned their cheerleaders from performing in any competitions associated with the group, but some say that's not fair. That online petition created by an anonymous person has garnered a lot of support. Some signers saying the ban on competition will keep these teams out of regional competitions and a larger competition in Florida. Some signers even wrote comments saying let them compete and that they earned this. The Wake County Public School System has not yet said whether they will reconsider their decision to let those athletes compete. Now, we also reached out to the law firm that filed that lawsuit. We have not yet heard back from them. In Raleigh, Dina Harley, CBS 17 News. All right, Dina, thank you.